um, like this one, that those documents are there for your evaluation and for your use and your digestion. So. And all I'm doing is just basing everything I'm saying on the evidence given to me and then okay. processing it from there. Mr. Mayor. Mr. Turner. Um, well, the information that I saw in the packet, um, if you compare it, to the, the memory, care, memory care facility, if you compare it to uh, the residential, potential residential units, we talked about six lots, one, one of them being a duplex lot. That translates to seven families. Uh, if you translate, if you compare the two, there's not a lot of difference in impact. The, the idea that there's going to be commercial trucks to this place in and out, I heard that there's only going to be two food deliveries a week. There's going to be people dropping people off. There's going to be a few employees, but compared to the number of people that would use that area if they had seven living units of homes with families, with teenagers, potentially. There isn't in much difference. In fact, there is some evidence to suggest that there's less impact. So if we're really talking about impact of traffic, I don't see that there's more impact with this facility. Uh, you know, I have a lot of stuff delivered by UPS and FedEx now. I do a lot of shopping by the internet. Um, that I'm, I'm assuming some of those homes would do the same thing, the number of truck if we were to, so I, I'm not convinced, me personally, that there's a difference, in, in much difference in impact. In fact, I think there might be less impact, a more controlled impact, one that we can affect more at this facility rather than homes. It's very difficult to tell people in homes what to do, ask them to do it. So uh, I'm not convinced in this issue of the traffic issue. Uh, that's my opinion. 